Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to uh, install the Aether mod for um, Mac and Minecraft version 1.4.7. Um, I found this way very uh, easy to do. This is a very simple uh, way to install the Aether mod considered it is hard. Um, so what you're going to want to do is click on the link below and you should get up a page that looks like this um and it'll say either mod my five zip dot zip want to download this okay it'll take a minute to download um this some stuff to say about this mod is that it's really uh easy to install so i highly recommend you follow the instructions on this video if you're really into installing the Aether mod. I made a last video that, uh, like, really stunk. In fact, it's probably the worst video I've ever done. Lots of views, yet lots of bad comments and stuff, so I just decided to screw that. Anyway, so, I'm making a new one. And, so, when it's done downloading, you should see a folder that says modded Minecraft. So, you're gonna wanna, um, don't, you don't need this website anymore. So you're gonna want to go Finder, Downloads. You probably find it, uh, and you should see a folder that says Mod Minecraft. You're gonna want to drag it out onto your desktop. Open it up. You should see two things, whether they look like folders or this. It just it, what matters is that it should say Minecraft.dar.zip, and another one should say Mod.zip. What you're gonna want to do is highlight them. Uh, right click on them or whatever and open them as archive utility app if you don't uh, have the archive utility app there is a trick all you have to do here I'll pretend to do it is uh, click compress and it'll do it for you I'll just show you what it does yeah so then see it just does that for you and uh, you don't need the utility archiver app for that um Okay, so what you're going to want to do next is you're going to want to um, go to your finder. Okay. Um, open up your finder. Okay, there we go. Uh, and go to your library, application support, Minecraft should be able to find it, it's not very hard, you can search it in here if you really need, or you can uh, do whatever you need to do, put it in go, and find it, whatever, it's pretty easy, anyway, so you're going to want to go to bin, and you should have something that says minecraft.jar, it should look like this, you're going to want to drag it out, and you're going to want to replace it with this, folder from your mod in minecraft folder okay you're going to go back resources and put in the mod folder okay okay now it's installed now but there's one more thing you're going to want to check is go to bin and open up your minecraft.jar folder and you're going to want to put it in the format so it looks like this type put just type m you should find the m class and look, and if you see any one of these things that says meta inf, then you're gonna want to delete that because that keeps you from installing the mod. Oh, oops. Sorry, that didn't like that. Okay, now should be installed. Um, I'm I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think you do have to delete those other two, the ones that we duplicated with the archive utility app. Force update done. Try again. Should work. Um. Oh, yeah. See, I'm pretty sure that you have to delete these. I always forget. Um, and that should install. Don't force update it this time. See, not now. Okay. Does it work? No, no, it didn't work. Oh, wait, yes, it did. 
Okay, so then the way you know if it works is it'll say I have like a little tip. And if that's not enough to convince you, voila, you should see this. Um you should say either, you should have these two buttons. Uh and that should just be just about it. Um anyways, if this doesn't work for you, leave a comment, I can help you. Uh otherwise than that, thanks for watching, comment rate, subscribe. And look out for my other videos. Thanks for watching and goodbye.